More thunderstorms are heading toward Minnesota this morning. That state does not need the rain. The Mississippi River is running well above flood stage this morning in St. Paul, Minnesota. The land of 10,000 lakes is struggling with its worst flooding disaster in decades. And this morning, the flood threat stretches from the Dakotas to Illinois. Meteorologist Megan Glaros of CBS station WBBM says it could get worse this weekend. Good morning. The country's midsection is getting pummeled again today. This morning, we're tracking more record rain. In Iowa, river levels are soaring. And in Minnesota, they've seen twice the normal amount of rainfall this month. Overnight, the mighty Mississippi roared as the river reached its highest levels in more than a decade. At 20 feet high, it's already above major flood stages. As towns have been washed out, people in more than half the counties in the state have been impacted by flooding. In 20 years, it's never been this bad. We made sure that FEMA uh, is already on the ground here. President Obama visited the hard hit state Thursday to assure them they wouldn't have to face this challenge alone. You should feel confident that you're going to have a strong partner uh, in FEMA and, and the federal government in the, the process of cleaning up. The cleanup has not been easy in the town of Blakely. It's still closed off after heavy rains and flash flooding triggered mudslides and forced the community to evacuate. It's a real mess. I got four inches of water on one side and about four and a half inches of water and mud combined throughout the whole basement. In nearby Iowa, waters are also rising to record levels. Torrential rains flooded roads and as creeks swelled, officials issued flash flood warnings. This water flow that's coming down here, it is definitely uh, the hardest and fastest I've ever seen it. It's, uh, it's, it's definitely the worst I've ever seen. And today, more than two-thirds of the lower 48 will be at risk for thunderstorm activity. The core of the most intense severe potential will be from the Canadian border down into Texas. There will be the possibility today of tornadoes, of strong winds, and also large hail. Very intense rains could also be a factor. In fact, torrential rains could fall across parts of the northern plains and the Midwest over the course of the next 48 hours. And for that reason, there are flash flood watches up from Montana into the Dakotas and down to Nebraska. Heavy rains will also exacerbate flooding that is ongoing across parts of the upper Midwest and the Great Lakes. Heat and humidity expected to build going into the weekend. Chicago will top out at 89 today, 80 degrees in New York City and 93 in Orlando.